Hello everyone, today it's going to be a really quick video. Um, it's going to be about something that's actually really important for macros, but it just never occurred to me to share this with you guys. Um, and it is about how to protect your macro codes so that other people cannot access it. So this is like a sample uh, file that I used before. And then if you go out to F11, you see, this is a code that I wrote for my purpose and it's embedded in this uh, this sheet. Sometimes it may embed in the module as well. So let's say for whatever exam, um, uh, uh, for whatever purpose, I don't want other people to show it, which means that even if they go outer F11, they couldn't see this. How do I do that? Uh, the way to do it is really simple. Um, now you are in this code in, in this sheet that you want. Go to tools and then go to VBA project pro, uh, properties. And then here on the tabs, go to protection. And then here, uh, take the log projects for reviewing and then put in your password. So I'm putting one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and then OK it and then save it. And then you can close the window and then save it in your file. And then actually now, if you do the outer F11, you'll find that you are still able to see it, but that's okay. You know what? Uh, you just need to close, make sure you save the file and then close it. And then reopen it. And let's see what ha what's happening. So here is the file. Now I want to see, let's say someone wants to see the code. They would go in, uh, do, outer F11 going here, this is what they're going to see. And then they go into the VBA projects and you are, and they will be asked for a point of password. And then let's say, you know, the password go in here and then it allows you to see everything below it. So for example, um, our modules and our sheets. Now, if you click on the sheet, you can see uh, you can see all the codes that you need and you can make adjustments there accordingly. Um, if you want to unprotect it, exactly same on tick, um, save, uh, get rid of the password. Okay. Save everything. And then it will be unprotected. So, um, that's it. It's really straightforward, but it's actually very important knowing that, especially when you have more knowledge and when you start to write more and more codes, and sometimes you might embed your passwords in the macro codes. And it is very important to hide it so that people who don't need to see it, don't see them and revise them. Okay. So that is everything I want to cover for today. I hope that is helpful to you. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you like it. If you have any question, please leave me a comment and I will talk to you very soon.